Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you the difference between Venmo Business versus Personal Account. So, what's the difference between Venmo Business versus Personal Account? So, I have a table here which shows the Venmo Business and Venmo Personal Account. So, the Venmo Business is best for sole proprietors, individuals, associations and registered businesses. And the Venmo Personal is best for anyone looking for or like looking to make peer-to-peer -peer transactions that's it simple and both of them have uh, account opening fee of none they have zero dollar of account opening fee whether you're opening a business account or personal account and the receiving fees of business is 1.9 percent plus zero point or 10 cents for every payment received of one dollar or more for Venmo personal account no fee when Venmo users send you payments using Venmo app not from the third party uh, or anything else okay so venmo business or is only allowed for the business and not allowed for personal users is venmo business different from venmo with a venmo personal account you can make peer-to-peer -peer transaction on top of this you can make payments to authorized business accounts but if you want to accept payments in return for a good or service that you offer then you need to open a venmo business account with venmo business account you can accept business payments can you use regular Venmo for business? You cannot use a personal Venmo profile for accepting business payments. What happens if you use personal Venmo for business? If you accept a payment for a good or service on your Venmo personal profile, Venmo might review the payment. During the review, Venmo may reserve the payment, causing you to lose it and the product or the service you sold. Venmo fees personal versus business. Now. Let's now take a look at Venmo business account versus personal account fees. Venmo business account are charged a fee on every received transaction that is equal to or greater than $1. This is known as the seller transaction fee and it is 1.9% plus 10 cents of the payment. It's the seller and not the buyer who has to pay the fees, which is in line with industry standards. So if a customer sends $200 to your Venmo business account, for example, then you will receive $196 plus 10 cents. It should be noted that these fees are not refundable. With the help of these fees, Venmo can provide business specific features and services. So with Venmo business account, you will get more specific features for your business with which you can grow your business more. So that's the main difference between Venmo personal and business account. If you find this video helpful and if this information was useful to you, then you can hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.